Bisa Beatty's missed a couple easy shots and then charged. And it's Wilkins to Couture. Couture's second three is a Hokie. Staggered screen. And that secondary help by Hammond. He gets his hand in there, forces the steal. A fade on the layup, but Aldrich cleans it up. 6'7", 205. It's now Jernigan who has the pleasure of matching up against Wabisa Beatty. Landers Nolly finds himself free, and Beatty set the stage for another assist. Dobb contested that shot. Hope he's flowing to their secondary offense. Horn, he hit three threes against Coppin. He's got four of his last five at home. They can't miss from beyond the arc. Virginia Tech, six of eight on threes. Beatty finds Radford. Tyrese Radford, the slash crash and an assist from Beatty. And this is fun. A three on one. Radford going up in the cross court reverse. He goes left to right, flies home. An offensive rebounds by Upstate now. That's something Mr. Mike Young will talk about at halftime. Beatty draws four defenders. P.J. Horn, thanks for finding me. Night, night, easy layup. Jalen Cohn all over White, but the driving dish and Zink continuing to control the game in the inside. It's to be a nice season in Spartanburg for the Spartans. Nolly with the clock under 10. You know what? I can shoot it from anywhere and make it from anywhere. First start of Tyrese Radford's career. It was tonight. And now we get to see P.J. Horn go to work in the post. Yeah, he doesn't, he doesn't do a lot of stuff with his back to the basket. The extra effort by Radford. We've got it again, minus Beatty and Horn. Three freshmen. Sweet look, Beatty. What a find. Really well done. See Upstate getting hot. They've hit three. But even with that, they're outscored 33 to nine from beyond the arc. Mike Young is 3-0 in his first season in Blacksburg.